Uh, what is up everybody welcome back to the channel um, yeah this is not the video we may have thought we making today obviously today is the release of the uh, first DLC pack uh, for Pokemon Sword and Shield uh, the Isle of Armor um, if you haven't seen my I guess trailer breakdown or trailer review uh, go and check that out uh, yeah it's on my channel um, but yeah um, so obviously Pokemon Presents was today at, uh, well, here in the UK, it was 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, I know that it was 6 a.m. and I think 9 a.m. Uh, uh, Eastern and Pacific times. Um, but yes, yeah, so obviously, I'm in the UK, so like I say it was, it was 2 o'clock. And to be honest, I thought with the release of the DLC, it was going to be a look at what we can expect from the DLC, perhaps some other features we haven't already seen. Um, that was not what it was. And I was pleasantly surprised by what we actually saw. Um, yeah, fantastic features in a way. Um, so the presentation started, um, and they jumped straight into a brand new app, uh, which I've actually downloaded today and used with my daughter. Uh, she's a massive Pokemon fan like I am, and we thought we'd try the Pokemon Smile app out. Uh, so if you don't know, Pokemon Smile is an app to make cleaning your teeth with your children more fun. Um, you know, if you haven't seen the presentation, um, then yeah, check it out. It's really great. Uh, but as I said, the app is essentially you. I think basically you you, you, you use. I, I couldn't get it on my phone, uh, but I did find it on my on the app store for Apple. Uh, I couldn't find it on the Play Store yet. Apparently, it's out for both. Uh, so if you have any luck finding it on the Play Store, let me know in the comments because that's why I couldn't find it on there. Uh, but I did find it on my on the Apple on the Apple App Store. Um, but yeah, you basically your child sets up an account, well, not account, but it's it's not, there's no payment involved at all. You just you kind of set up your birthday. Uh, if you're a girl or a boy, you can choose to not put any of this information in. Uh, we did, uh, but obviously we chose not to share it with anyone. Um, and you get to pick your Pokemon. There's Pikachu, Charmander, Bulbasaur, uh, Eevee, um, and I think that's it until you unlock more. And the idea is that as uh, you then basically it works like an augmented reality app. Uh, so your child will clean their teeth and on screen they'll wear a hat, a Pokemon hat. So I think my daughter has Pikachu, so as it is, and I like on the side of it. Um, and you then clean your teeth. Uh, it shows you where to clean them, how to clean them, and if you're doing fast enough, it'll tell you to speed up, clean your teeth faster. Um, and you then Pikachu will attack. Uh, cavities and germs in your mouth on the screen um, eventually you'll unlock Pokemon and that Pokemon you'll then battle, battle off all those like, cavities and germs in your mouth um, and yeah you'll fight off it eventually when you've done I think it'll be it like 95 seconds um, sorry so just over two minutes um, yeah just over two minutes um, actually I lied, under two minutes a minute and a half Rather, I don't know how to do that um, yeah, so it's, no, it's, you can change that in the settings. Uh, we haven't yet, but I might do. We normally do two minutes. With um, but yeah, and then you unlock Pokemon, and it's Master Ball pops up on the screen, and my daughter flicks it, um, and it caught a Pidgey. Uh, we then unlock the Pidgey, um, and you can view it in like a Pokedex form. Um, I'm not sure how many Pokemon there are to collect, so if there's all of them, I probably doubt it. Um, it was quite fun. She quite enjoyed cleaning her teeth and trying to sort of battle away the cavities. Um, you also can also say you have different hats. So we unlocked a Squirtle hat, from, oh, sorry, an Eevee hat, playing the first time. And then you can, when you've got, it, it takes your picture, use your camera on your device, uh, to take your child's picture as it's as you're cleaning as they're cleaning their teeth, <coughs> which is quite funny. When they finish cleaning their teeth, it shows you four images. Uh, you can save as many as you want. We saved one of them. And you unlock stickers you can then apply to the image. Uh, you can change the background and then you can save the image. And when we save the image, we unlock a bubble sort of, uh, hat for her to wear. Obviously, it's not an actual hat, um, it's sort of almost reality. So, when, it, when the camera sees your eyes, it puts out your head, it works for adults, it works for children. Uh, so, you know, if you were an adult and wanted to clean your teeth with Pokemon Smile, you can. So, that's what you do. Um, I haven't yet, believe it or not. Um, but yeah, um, 
Yeah, I guess they're not, they don't, they don't look like Pokemon, but they're not the more TV like They've got a little sort of more like ditto eyes, a bit more chubby looking, a little more cutesy. Um, but yeah, quite a fun outfit altogether. Um, second on the announcement was the Pokemon Cafe Mix. Um, isn't actually out yet, but it's coming soon. Um, essentially, looks like a Candy Crush slash Pokemon Cafe game, where Pokemon will visit your, will visit your cafe, uh, and you'll have to you'll have them in like a. a then, to be honest, yeah. Um, it, looks, it looks like a Candy Crush. I was, just, I was gonna say, to be honest, um, quite confusing. The trailer I was watching it at work. Um, basically, yeah. So you've got a very Candy Crush environment. Uh, you have to like get lines of Pokemon. They all roll around on the screen. Um, like I said it's much it's much better explained on the on the presentation. Um, but yeah, quite a fun app. Um, and also coming out for the Switch as well. So you can play it on your device, phone, uh, tablet, whatever you've got. But also, if you've got a Switch, play it on there as well. Um, thirdly, um, a game that I haven't actually ever played, always wanted to, uh, Pokemon Snap, uh, which recently came out for the N64. Which saw you going around on a buggy or on a train or a buggy, taking pictures of Pokemon, trying to spot different Pokemon with your camera. Um, Pokemon Snap is coming to Nintendo Switch very soon. Uh, there was no announcement date on the presentation. Uh, they did show it if you like. You're in like a hover buggy and you go around taking pictures of Pokemon. Um, I'm very excited for this. Um, having never played the original, I'm really looking forward to playing the new one. Um, but yeah, so yeah, you know, like I say, you can basically go around for what the trailer showed. Uh, there's different Pokemon games you can go and find, take pictures, um, and then you can, you can view those pictures later on. Um, yeah, like I said, a really, really fun game. Um, you know, if you go back to the presentation, there was um, there was a lot of talk on Pokemon Go. Um, I actually missed that part of it. Um, because I didn't watch the whole thing. Um, so there was there was talk of Pokemon Go and what they're adding, um, and obviously the continued research with that. And there was obviously talk about the DLC. Um, they showed, I guess, uh, I think the trailer they've already showed uh, with the giant Wowmar and Kafu. Um, but you know, just nice to see. And obviously at the end of the presentation, uh, they said obviously it's now available to download. Uh, mine was downloading when I got home, um, as I had my Switch with me, and they, I didn't have access to Wi-Fi. Um, so as soon as I got here, it downloaded. I'm yet to play it. Um, I really wanted to get this video out now, um, just because, you know, the presentation was really fantastic. I hadn't expected to see anything like that on there. Um, just see the new Pokemon Smile, uh, the Cafe Mix app, uh, and, you know, Pokemon Snap. All, I had no idea they were coming. I didn't see anything online about them, so it looked like a big surprise to most people. Um, and yeah, obviously, you know, great looking at Pokemon Go and the new DLC. Um, yeah, so check it out if you haven't already checked it out. Um, you know, thanks to the Pokemon Company. Um, you know, none of, obviously this is my own opinion. Um, you know, I'm not paid to say anything like this at all. Um, I really enjoyed the presentation. You know, I can't wait to get started on my Isle of, Isle of Armour adventure. Um, you know, essentially swapping out a whole roster of Pokemon which I've already got from Sword and putting it into Isle of Armour. And then switching it out because I know there's Pokemon I'm gonna to wanna to collect, um, you know, in the new aisle. Um, yeah, uh, let me know in the comments if you're excited for Pokemon, if you saw the presentation, if you enjoyed the presentation, if it wasn't what you thought it was gonna be. Um, you know, if you downloaded any of the apps, let me know in the comments below. Um, I said like, consider like, subscribe to the video. Um, I said if you're new to the channel, uh, consider subscribing. Um, you know, I like making these videos. You know, this is this is really for me. Um, but I like to know that people out there like to see what I'm putting out. Um, I'm constantly trying to upgrade the gear I use and kind of the style of doing it. Um, so if you've got any ways you think I can make it better, um, that's it, leave them in the comments below. Uh, a like on the video is always appreciated. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching, bye for now.